Hey, my name is Chef Dickerson and welcome to this channel. And in this video, we're gonna talk about email marketing for beginners. Why is it so important? What should you be doing? And everything in between. Now, I've been in business for 17 years now. I've had all the ups and downs that you get as an entrepreneur and as a business owner. And along the way, I've discovered something very, very special called the Business Accelerator Methodology. Now, you can find out all about how that works in a free copy of my book, Expert Master. I'm going to put a link in the description so you can grab a copy of that here today. Now, what that methodology has allowed me to do is actually build a huge database in my business of over 130,000 UK business owners. And I've discovered along the way some stuff that's very, very important when you're looking to build a list. Let's go through those and see how they work. So first is you've got to be always building your list, right? You've got to have different ways that people can opt in. People are not just going to go to your website, make an inquiry and buy your product and service in this day and age. They've got so many options. They're evaluating whether you're a good fit, whether you can work together and all of this important stuff. And so if you want to get the lead, if you want to get the email address so you can nurture that relationship, so you can show them everything they need to know to be able to make a decision to be able to work with you, you've got to give some value and give something away. So the best way to build an email list, email list, email list, an email list, is to give something away, like a guide or report, a discount voucher. Maybe they can opt in for some free training or opt in for tickets for live events. Those are a few things that we use, um, but there are hundreds of them. There are hundreds of different things. And what I'm saying is that you give something away of value. Let's see here. Um, this is something that we give away. It's a guide on using virtual assistants in your business. And so people can opt in and get the PDF version of this. And to get this, they have to give me their name and their email address, right? That's how this works. And so that is constantly building my list. Other ways that I do it is I offer lots of free training to entrepreneurs and business owners just like you. But to get on the training, you've got to register, right? And so you've got to opt in to get the uh, training links and stuff like that. And that means I've got a lead and I can follow up with that person afterwards. I also work with some e-commerce stores and what they do is they get people to opt in to get a discount voucher, maybe for shipping or something like that. That's very, very important. So you've got to always be building your list. Now, once you've got a list, it's important that you look after the health of your list. What does that mean? It's not a human, right? You don't have to give it vitamin C and vitamin D, but you do need to have list hygiene. You see, how it works is when you build your list, you're going to use some marketing software to promote your products and services. And you can use something like Active Campaign or MailChimp or Keep. Infusionsoft, there's tons of them, right? But these companies have deals with Google, Yahoo Mail, Microsoft, and all the other companies in between. And what their deals are is that they will make sure that people are not spamming. So how they do that is they check that you're not sending to loads of emails that are just dead, right? As in they don't exist um, or they've been closed down. And so when you send emails out, all of these softwares, whichever one you use, will say, hey, look, you sent an email to this person and it bounced back. It wasn't a real address or it's gone away. And so what you must do is make sure that you remove that email and don't keep sending to it. If you keep sending to it, then your provider is gonna stop your emails going out and maybe shut your account with them, which of course is something that you don't want to have. So that's really, really, really important. Now, other things that you want to happen is people to actually read your emails. Most people aren't gonna read your emails. You doing well is if you've got 100 people in your list and 20 of them read it, 20% open rate, very, very good. Some people with bigger lists, it's way down in the 10%. And so you must look at, if someone doesn't open your email again and again and again for weeks or months, take them out of your list, right? Because the more healthy, the higher open rate, the more likely it is you're gonna end up in the inbox and not in the junk mail. That's very, very key here. And so health of your email is very, very important. So always be looking after your list. Last but not least, is value. You see, the only company that can really get away with just offering you products for sale constantly is Amazon, right? They're different. We're not like that. 
And so we have to give value first. And so what I teach people on my academy is we build this stuff out with our academy members all the time. They must send free emails of value per week. And value means sending people to a blog post that can help them, a YouTube video that can help them, a LinkedIn post. I don't know what it is that they're gonna use, but it's something useful to that prospect. That means that prospect is more likely to open it. They're more likely to look forward to it. They're gonna make sure that it, it means that they're gonna know you, they're gonna like you, and they're gonna trust you. Because if you just said, hey, here's an email, here's something for sale, people will look at it for a second and then they forget about who you are. But if you email to somebody and it sends them to a video and they watch a 10 minute video and get some value, they're gonna remember you the next day or a week later. <clears throat> and so that's gonna help them move down the position of deciding whether they want to work with you. Then you need to send some promotions to these people from time to time as well. Maybe a couple of times a week, you'll send, hey look, here's an option to buy something or book a call, but not every single email. Now, when you're looking to put this all together, you're gonna build a list and you're gonna do all of this stuff. You're gonna use a system like ActiveCampaign or MailChimp or whatever system that you want, but you're gonna need the methodology and that starts with the Business Accelerator methodology. So if you really wanna get this stuff now, do grab a free copy of Expert Mastery. I'm gonna put a link in the description so you can grab your free copy here today. And look, I've got tons of other email marketing tips on this channel, so go and check out all those other videos. Do comment below, let me know your thoughts on this. Like the video, subscribe and hit the bell as well. I'm James Nicholson, stay blessed and keep me updated with how your marketing is going. Bye for now.